can't see them very well, I imagine. But there's a whole line of ducks right there, that little group. Looks like a bunch of small ones. Probably Euro. I've been seeing a lot of ducks out here. Geese. People are fishing all the time out here. Nice place. You can hear it's real quiet. Nobody running a generator, huh? Because every one of these sites have electricity. Most of them have that cover. Well, down here they have a cover. That one doesn't have one. They don't have covers over them up there on the top of the hill. There's a whole bunch of spots up there. But it's gorgeous down here. Quiet. Peaceful. This is our site. We got this little whatever gazebo thing that somebody's decorated. Fire pit. Broken picnic table. There's a good picnic table. I'm parking this way because the electric on this site is right behind where the van is. I'm sorry. Let me change this. There. Make it more normal. But there's the electric back there. And I think it's just 20 amp. That's what I'm plugged into. And that's the only thing available on this pole. 20 amp. I'm not the most level, but it's pretty comfortable. Somebody's decorated this. I don't know if you can see it. It's just shiny purple whatever there you go ain't that cute got a little bit of screening around it somebody lived here for a while I guess left the rug but we're at the very end spot on the lake this is Cox Creek Lake Campground and boat ramp. Let's see. Like, uh, like I said, there's a, there's only 20 amp. That's it too. It was raining last night, and I kept worrying whether or not that was gonna catch on fire. I don't think there's anything down there in that bottom plug. Just an old breaker. I'm not gonna reach my hand down in there. I'm not sure what that box is to the side there, but uh, yeah, there's a wasp around that when it gets warm. Bro, where you go, bud? Come over here. But we're all the way at the end, and this got wet last night. I thought, oh boy, <laughs> it's okay. I'm not planning on going anywhere, so not for a little bit. This is a, uh, oh, and up on top of the hill, there is a bathhouse with toilets, and I think it has showers, and there's a water spigot up there for you to fill your tanks. Brutus, come on. Get over here. Come here now. Right now. Sometimes he's a hard head. But. Dinky, you too. Come on. But up there is a bathhouse. I believe there are showers. There is a water spigot outside to fill your tanks or whatever you need to fill. And I do believe there's showers. I'm not sure. Um, there are trash cans, uh, the plastic 55-gallon barrels on a post right up there. So there's trash pickup here too. And electricity. People, you can't beat this. And... It's nine dollars a night. <laughs> the beauty of it all, huh? For nine bucks. Isn't the birds singing? It's a little cloudy today because it's been raining. It's beautiful. Calm. Quiet. Plenty of room, room for my babies to explore. They don't go too far away. They push it sometimes, but most of the time they don't. 
orb right up against the trees and the hill. So wind coming through don't bother unless it comes off of that lake and they hadn't done that yet. People apparently live across the lake somewhere. Some kind of little dam over there. But $9 a night, you can't beat this with a big stick. You know, and I think you get a discount if you're a senior. So, it's, it's pretty clean. They keep this thing clean. There ain't a bunch of loud, noisy people. I don't know about the weekend. I hadn't made it that far yet. So, we'll see. That's private property back there, I guess. Though, I did see a pickup truck go up through there a while ago, and he didn't look like nothing authorized. But it's okay. If they own it, they can do what they want. Hardly anybody comes down here and bothers anybody. It's all good. But this is our first full day we got here yesterday. This is our first full day. So we'll see what else there is after a while. I'll show you a little bit more. Okay. So we're just sitting out here chilling in a little gazebo over there and we got company. They just swam right up and they look like they're going to walk up here in a minute. Dogs are just watching them. They're watching the dogs. <laughs> Picking up some kind of somethings out of that water to eat. Brutus, come here. You don't know what that is. He thinks he's going to find out, doesn't he? <laughs> They're barking at him. Oh, he's like tapping the water. Like, come here. He's challenging him. I don't think Bruce is going to do it, though. He's just standing there. <laughs> I think he's she's laying right there. I don't think he knows what to think about it. I think this is his first goose. His first encounter with geese. He don't know. He won't get in that water either. He's just going to stand there and watch him. Oh, he peed in front of him. I guess that was his challenge. Boy. <laughs> oh, I hear a bunch more coming. I think they called for backup. Brutus, you might be in trouble, buddy. They may have called for help. They may have coming after you. Cause it sure sounds like there's a bunch of them over there somewhere coming this way. I don't know. These two ain't moving. They're challenging. This must be their space where they like to come and get on the bank and sunbathe. Bruce got tired. He walked away. No, nope, now he's interested. They made a noise. <laughs> okay. Don't know what'll happen with this one, but... We have company. Oh, well, here we are. It's our last day here. We're leaving in the morning. And today we got actual ducks came to visit. Well, you can hear him, but my camera's kind of... There he is. And there's another one. And they came over to visit. And now they're leaving. This is Saturday, April 9th. This place is full. It's packed up. I mean, they're not right on top of me yet. But they will be when I wake up, I'll bet you. All of these spots will be full. There's one spot here. Still on the lake. Still available. No cover over the table. No nothing, really. But it's got electric. There's actually two spots there. And up on top of that hill, people are starting to set their tents up. So. These ducks. <laughs> they just came up pretty close. We're just come up here, baby. He likes to go down that swampy stuff. There might be a snake. Brutus, come up here. Come on. 
people that walking across that dam, they go over there and fish at that other end. I don't know what's down there, but I haven't made the walk. I'm too lazy. Hey, look at this. It's looking like a regular boat dock. People are parking their boats all. There's one. There's one up there. Parking their boats right along the campsites. You can do that here. Isn't that nice? Comes the day else, I don't know. But it's a beautiful day today. The sun came out. Not real windy. Weather's nice. Somebody having a problem with the boat down there. Can't get it started. Ain't nobody really bothered me up here. I imagine during a busy time, though. I imagine they will. I imagine this whole thing is circled. I don't care that probably this is probably the boondocking is. It does have an electric post, which I am hooked up to. I'm a senior, so seven dollars a night. Real good. I'll be leaving tomorrow. I'm gonna head up toward the home pace. Uh, I gotta pick up some mail. Pick up my lumber. I got a little bit more work to do. I've decided finally what I'm going to do with this side over here. Oh. Where all of that stuff is. The refrigerator, that little cabinet. I want the refrigerator stove both over here. Stove on this end, so it'll be close to that door. Yeah, that big stove that's buried under there. So they will both be usable, and I'm hoping I'll be able to make a little shelf or something up across here. But anyway, that's the plan. I'm going to go pick up the lumber. Go down to the campground. It's got electricity, probably. And hang out there for about a week. See what happens. See if I can build some stuff. But... I think she likes that rug. <laughs> she won't even get on the pillow. She gets on the rug. <laughs> Coach Brew. She likes his food. You gotta eat. That's your boy. I mean, but yeah. It's kind of a little bit of a mess. I got stuff scattered all over in here still yet. But I get turned around. Okay, but this is what it is right now. Uh, that is straight across the back, all the way to the back. Gives me more. I don't know, more space up here, look at this. Look at how wide this is. Lots of space. I'll get it figured out. But, this is where we are. Uh, it's, oh gracious me. <laughs> I forgot. Cox Creek Lake Campground and Boat Watch. I was camping all up around the lake, all the way that way. And then up here on top, there's tent camping up there. Everybody's got electric, even the tent. Some's got nice little covers and awnings. Picnic tables, there's some ducks coming back. I haven't really been up there and looked at much. I've got everything I need inside here. So, and I just ain't been feeling it. It's been, it's actually the last few days been cold and windy. So we've just been kind of hanging out inside mostly. Thank you for enjoying every bit of it. I'm very just curious about these ducks. He doesn't like the geese. The geese are mean. Of course they are. They're big and bossy. Okay, looking at them ducks. I think they're taunting him just a little bit. 
<laughs> Alright, anyway, we'll leave it with that. I'll come back again.